Hello and welcome to another Stack Team App Help video. In this video, we're going to show you how to manually invite members to your app. Please also, once you've watched this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and hit the bell icon so you get notified when we upload new videos. Manually adding your members can be done via the app, but it's easiest to invite them using the Stack Team App website dashboard at stackteamapp.com. The first step is to create access groups, which enables you to place specific members into groups that will help you streamline communication. You can then easily create new access groups and have as many as you wish. When posting content, creating events or chat rooms, you can choose which access groups receive that information. You have multiple options to get members onto your app, the first being manual entry. To do this, click on the members tab on the website dashboard, then click the three dots to the right, then select add member. From here, you simply enter the information for this person. Name is mandatory, though everything else is optional. You should enter a new member as themselves, not parent's email with a child's name. We'll talk about child and parent or guardian alignments later in this video. Once you get to the bottom, click Create. Upon creation, anytime you enter an email address, that person will be sent an automated email advising they've been added to your app with simple instructions on how to download Stack Team App to become a registered app member. If they don't download Stack Team App, because you've added their email, they'll automatically get content via email. To individually add a guardian or child, simply click on any member, and then you'll see the option to add the guardian or a child. You can add a new child or select a child from your existing members list. If you click on the child, you will see a newly added guardian, where then you can choose to make them a primary or non-primary guardian. It's important to remember that with the child guardian alignment, remember only to have the child as the member in the access group. So only the child's name will appear in features like RSVP and attendance tracking lists and not the name of the guardian or the parent. You will now notice the access group each guardian's child belongs to is represented by a child icon next to the access group name, whilst the access group they belong to as a standalone member are in plain gray. Finally, at any time, you can simply encourage prospective members to download Stack Team App from the App Store or Google Play. They can also head to our website at stackteamapp.com and search for your app name and request access to become a member where you can then approve them or deny their access. Thanks for watching another Stack Team App help video. As always, if you have any further questions about manually adding members or any other Stack Team App feature, contact us at stackteamapp.com.